called them then. NASCAR, is it? Uh, I, I didn't get called to meet him with anybody. I've been a good boy. So. Well, about safety. You got yeah. to talk to NASCAR at all? Were you part of this group? I no, I haven't. I don't know what there is to talk about. I mean, there's people working on projects and they are where we are. So, we're just trying to still drive through it. What's the most important project? Oh, wow. Um, I can't sit and say I have a ranking in front of me. Um, I would say probably trying to understand what's going on with the, the tires blowing out and at uh, the last two weeks and uh, you know some of the crashes uh, that came with it. What's the feeling going into this event? I mean, two drivers already out because of impacts. Mm -hmm. This is a place where you know it's it, it seems like guys are always on a little bit heightened or a little bit yeah. more tension. What? What's what's the tension or anxiety level going into this weekend? Based yeah, it's it? a little bit of a time warp back to you know early two thousands, and you know I, I think uh, you, the racing will be just a little bit different accordingly. Maybe I don't know if that's better or worse, but uh, a little bit of a time warp. Um, you know I think we, we've gotten to a point where for a, while, for a while there the racing was so aggressive because nobody was ever afraid of getting hurt, and um, you know uh, who knows maybe it'll. it'll come back a little bit which probably isn't a bad thing does that mean single file or just i don't know if you'll see that um maybe just some of the less gratuitous uh moves that seem really terrible you remember when rusty wallace stood up in the driver's <laughs> meeting many years ago because we had a couple of practice crash deaths and he said you guys got to race differently and it was um, mm -hmm. Kind of a story. I don't know if you remember that. Was I do. Yeah. And you think about wheel drivers really race differently because they know that you know they could get a concussion or they're seeing this in reality now. Uh, oh, I, whether they will admit it or not, there's no doubt you race differently when you're you know more afraid of getting hurt. Um, so uh, we all have business decisions to make there. Um, as to how it affects who and what amount, I, I wouldn't say I'm an expert on that. Right. You, you on, you're one of the guys who's accused often of making too daring of a move here on track. So, would you race differently? I don't think so. No, I'm, I'm pretty comfortable with the moves that I make here. Brad, on, on race hub, you had a really good breakdown of Bowman. You know, his head was a little bit off the seat. Now they're saying, you know, maybe if the driver's head is back, could that make a difference? Can Can you tell yourself when you're wrecking to put your head back? Is that yeah, something that's I mean, it happens easy? really fast, Jeff. So, you know, I, I think. Generally, you know, you, you can train to some extent on things like that, but you know, ultimately, when you're in the heat of the moment, it doesn't always work out. Uh, but you know, for some of us, hopefully, we can you know, learn from that and, and be able to apply it. I know that I don't. I hope not to be in that situation where I have to apply it. But if I do find myself in it, I'm going to try to. Are you doing anything in your car to change it? Yeah, we changed some of the padding uh, to that regard and, and really tighten up the back of my head rest so that uh, you know I can't have a really sharp movement backwards for this week so um i think that should be helpful is that for this week Brad? yeah but we you know i normally do that for the plate tracks anywhere but i'm just doing it for now why is do it, you think it is that you're seemingly less upset frustrated i think frustration is the word we, we heard mm. it from chase elliott today and some of the other drivers you probably yeah. know that because you hear from the other drivers um maybe it's because i have so many other things to be frustrated <laughs> about right um no, I, I think um, there's people working on it. I mean, it, it'd be one thing if there was a magic wand with a solution that just wasn't being applied. Uh, it'd be one thing if nobody was working on anything. But there's people working on things right now, and there's projects underway, like <coughs> kind of having reasonable expectations of those projects. Mm -hmm. um, the fact that there's movement and there's acknowledgement and NASCAR's working on things is uh, confidence is fine for me. Do you feel like maybe 